what's going on vv gang welcome back to the channel all things strange it's your man dr strange and we are back in action so you know i'm asking are we stacking or slacking on looks like we getting fantastic four annual number six first appearance and birth of franklin richards the son of Reed and Sue Richards. Interesting, very interesting. We gotta dive in, see if this book is worth stacking or slacking on. So let's see what the VB Twitter fam is talking about. Definitely gotta see some CGC price values on this book. So let's dive in real quick. All right, so here we are on VB's Twitter page, checking out Fantastic Four Annual number six. Looks like we're getting some exclusive brand ultra rare covers by Nicoletta Paul oh, Derry. It's going to drop Thursday, May 11th, 8 a.m. Pacific time. So yeah, fam is feeling it. Ultra rare covers look nice. Let's dive in. We got Adam, the fam, hooking us up with some Go Collect info. According to Go Collect, a 9.8. They're nine on the census, two sales, fair market value of 19,000. A CGC 9.6 has a fair market value of 12,500. A 9.4 will get you 4,300. 9.2, 2,350. So there you have that. Definitely going for some nice change on the 9.8 level. Definitely some decent sentiment for this drop 324 likes 227 likes so let's dive on in to the vv blog article get some further drop details because i want to know how many additions we're getting and check out these covers let's dive in we are here vv's blog site check it out fantastic four annual number six the first appearance and birth of franklin richards the son of reed and sue richards the baby is coming with Sue going into labor, Reed must take a perilous journey to obtain element X, the only thing that can keep the baby safe from the cosmic rays in Sue's body. The bad news, it can only be found in a negative zone. The worst news, it's in the hands of one of the deadliest beings in the universe, Anilius. This release features VV exclusive rare ultra rare covers by Nicoletta Baldari. It's going to have a list price in $6.99 which is always good published 1968 five cover variants 5,000 total editions first available edition for public sale is 158 we're getting 3,000 classic cover commons 1,125 vintage variant uncommons 500 hero variant rares 250 vibranium variant ultra rares only 125 True Believer variant secret rares. There is a purchase limit of three on the drop. Blind boxes, that is. Total of 287 editions across all five rarities are going to be withheld by Vivi. So you have that there. Let's check out these covers, man. Let's dig in. Check it out. Let's check out the common here. 25 cent joint. Definitely got that classic vibe, man love books like this the color palettes just it's that classicness man classic goodness let there be life so that's dope man let's check out the uncommon you know what we're gonna get pretty much and yeah this is a dope one only got the fantastic four highlighted here i like the little touch of the label in the corner too i like how it's like blacked out the characters it makes it pop so I wouldn't be mad with Uncommon, you know what I'm saying, other than the price value, of course, in the secondary market. That is what it is for now. So let's check out the Rare by Nicoletta. And this is kind of dope, man. Um, this is one of the first comics I think I've seen where she's actually doing male characters. And the thing is looking crazy over here. I like this. I really do dig this cover. Got the baby. Yeah, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. Let's check out the Ultra Rare. This definitely brings it all together. Yeah, she killed this one, man. She killed this one. You know, I like how they got that, like, classic look still. You know? 
but it's definitely got a fun vibe to it. They they picked the right person for this book, you know, for this cover. So let's see what the cover this secret rare is gonna give us. All right, classic panel pull action. Baby is born. Come in and meet your new son. So bam, there it is. I mean, not the most exhilarating secret rare cover, but it is what it is, man. So I don't know if I'm slacking or stacking on this one at all. Not really sure what I'm doing. I mean, I like the price value on it. Um, let me head on over to, we're gonna go to Key Collector, see if I can see some more info on this book. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are on Key Collector Comics, checking out Fantastic Four Annual Number Six. This dropped in November 1968. As you can see on the right-hand side of the screen, this was a key. So this had a low of 160, a mid of 600, and a high of 1.9K. We're talking about uh, some raw books, I would think, man. But um, key facts, first appearance of Anilius. Anilis, ruler of the negative zone, first appearance of Franklin Richards as an unnamed infant, considered by Marvel to be the most powerful mutant in the Marvel Universe. Interesting. Introduction of the cosmic control rod, a weapon used by Anilis that manipulates matter. So yeah, this is uh, some interesting key facts here. I'm gonna head on over to eBay for my final verdict. From a stack of slack with Fantastic Four Annual number six. Figure this out. Okay, guys, here we are on eBay. Checking out Fantastic Four Annual number six. And you know how I like to do. I'm here at highest price plus shipping. Get right. Whoa. Somebody want $80,000? What? For a 9.8? going on over here I don't understand it's not signed by anybody uh, what's going on 9.8 so they're one of the nine okay this is book going up that much I mean why you charge 80,000 though what's going on over here wow okay 9.4 they want 7,500 9.2, 6,400. 9.2, 4,100. Okay. So, yeah, I'm not sure why the fam up top is going so crazy. This one is signed by Stan Lee at 8.5. Personally, I'd rather have something like that. So, yeah, I mean, this cover is super fire. I can't really say something you know negative about that the book definitely pops you know it's a classic uh it's an important comic you know as far as characters i don't think fantastic for that big but you know the big screen can turn all of that around within a couple of years look at guardians i always say that you know their comics were never really sought after like that. So, but look at them, you know, they're, they're just as known as relevant as a Fantastic Four currently. So, movies is the key, and we know the Fantastic Four are gonna have their uh, time in the sun. Personally, you know, in the background, like I've been grabbing uh, Fantastic Four number ones, Fantastic Four first appearance of Mariners, you know. So, I'm letting everybody chase all the other stuff for now. Just sticking with what I know, man. But as far as stacking and slacking on Fantastic Four Annual Number Six, um, I like the list price of six ninety nine. As far as the, the mint run, five thousand total editions. That's really nice and in the cut, right where I like it. I feel like you know this is going to be a drop worth going for at that price point. These covers are dope, rare, ultra rare. Common, uncommon, secret rare, and eh, it's okay. So if I land a secret rare, to be real, I'll probably let that go. But yeah, this feels like a go, honestly. For $6.99, 5K run, I think that's a perfect, just a perfect drop. 
you know, for a book like this. You know, not the biggest book in the world, but as we can see from eBay, you know, and Go Collect, you know, in a high grade, this book is definitely decent. So I'm probably gonna try and go for all three attempts um, on the drop. Uh, to be honest, I think I'm gonna max this one out. I'm not sure though, I'm not sure. But you know, I always do. Definitely gonna go for one, you know? And we'll see where it lands in the aftermarket. You know, this one could easily fall below retail. I mean, the common should go below retail in, in many respects, you know? But it's about how far under retail. So if it's, you know, landing around $4, $4.50, I think it's worth going for the attempts you know on the drop all three but that's just what i'm doing let me know down below what you guys are doing let me know if you're stacking the slacking on fantastic four annual number six but for now your man dr strange all things strange is out